we are back with a new year and some new tools for fossil preparation. One of those tools being a Dremel and or the technical term for it, I believe, is a rotary tool. Um, but yeah, that's the tool we were using in today's video. Um, but basically, we were just popping a clam fossil out of its uh, rock so we can better see what it was to see if we could try and figure out exactly um, what kind of fossil it was. Um, it didn't really help much, but the fossil came out in perfect condition, which is always good, especially since it was my first time trying the tool. Um, with that being said, um, I had to wear a mask while using this tool, so I wasn't able to explain really what I was doing while I was doing it. So at any point during this process, if you have any questions, just leave your questions down below in the comments and then I'll be more than happy to answer them. But without further ado, let's get to work. Okay, we are back. That did not take nearly as long as I thought it would. Um, here. That's the bit we have in now. Just to give you an idea how small that is, that's what we had in before. So there's definitely a difference there. Um, I'm going to try and keep it at a lower RPM so I don't snap the drill bit. But yeah, that's basically where we're at now. Um, let's see where this gets us. So here's our little clam fossil. Um, as you can see, it came out pretty nice. Uh, I really couldn't get it much better than this. Uh, there's still some small stuff on the surface, but that will just stay there. Um, it's actually kind of small. You see, watch this. Zoom way out. It's a small guy. And then you zoom way in looks really big now I can't hold it steady anyway so that's the clam fossil that we got out um yeah nothing really went wrong so there's not really much to say um I will say this though there are plenty more fossils like these than this one so this probably won't be the last time you'll see fossils like these um but yeah if you want to see more of this kind of stuff, let me know, uh, because I've got a bunch of them. But that's basically it for today's video, so thank you for watching, and tune in next time.